Good morning guys, my name's Ashley and today I thought that I would just film a little update Q&A because I feel like I haven't done a Q&A in a really long time. So of course as always I asked you guys on my Instagram to leave me some questions just like on one of my stories so I will be looking through some of those. Why am I sweating so bad? Why am I sweating so bad? Whoa, the light is like changing outside. That was crazy. Okay. Okay, before I actually look through any of the questions, let me just get some of the basics out of the way. So like I said, my name's Ashley and I am 20 years old. I'm going to be 21 on October 23rd. Born in 1999. I'm from New York. I live in upstate New York and I have for my entire life and I'm half white. so like British, Scottish, French. And then the other side is just Korean. So my mom is Korean and my dad is white and they met in optometry school. So that's really awesome my mom made a whole post about it on her instagram the other day and i was like it was literally the cutest post that i've ever seen so i actually still live at home with them i commute to college so i still live in my same bedroom as you guys know i did go to george washington university for one semester and then after that i went to rpi i still go there i'm a senior i'm graduating in the spring so that is going to be interesting and my boyfriend also goes to nearby college so we're both in the same hometown area he has lived here since he was like in first grade i think and he came here from manila so he was from paranaque now he's here in upstate, beautiful upstate New York. So quite a change of scenery for him. So he can speak Tagalog as well, and I can speak English. But I'm also trying to learn French, and I'm like, I'm like getting there with French. So we'll see how it works out. By the way, guys, if you want like some like really in detail descriptions of like my life, like what I do every week, like just updates every week about my life, I talk about that a lot on my podcast. So like on my podcast, like I have an entire podcast about my college experience, my high school experience, um, just like a general get to know me for me, Amber, my sister, Andrew, my brother, even one for Charles, but maybe my parents one day soon. That'd be really cool. But yeah, I still want to answer some questions on here also look at my home screen it's my charles he's so beautiful yeah yeah let's just go through some of these questions one that i get all the time is how tall am i and i am five five i'm actually probably like five four and a half so not super tall not super short just like regular height i feel like do we have korean names like me and my sibling we actually do not have korean names is there anywhere you want to go after covid is over i would love to go to obviously korea manila I want to go to like Asian countries because I've never been to Asia, so like Singapore. It would just be so cool to like go to that part of the world because I've never been there before. I think it would also be cool to go back to London and Paris, which I've been to both of them once, I think like five years ago. Where else do I want to go? Montreal. Sometimes, like I just want to go to like Colorado or like Arizona, just like states in the US that like have the Grand Canyon or something. Just for like a change of scenery from here, you know what I'm saying? I want to go see some rock formations. That's what truly interests me. Or waterfalls as well yes how's the discord going it's going very nicely i don't think have i even talked about the discord on my channel yet i don't know but basically i decided to make a discord if you guys don't know what discord is it's sort of just like a place where you can like go and chat or like you can join like voice calls on my discord like we'll do little games or i'll just join your guys's chats or like join like a vc like a voice call and just like talk with you guys and i think it's also the best way to get like a reliable notification when my video comes out because we have like a bot that automatically like sends a notification to everyone when the videos come out so if you keep on your notifications for discord like you'll get that notification what is your most favorite fit of charles probably the one that's my home screen or i think there's one where he's like standing next to his car next to his bike attached to his car and i like that outfit as well but i like all of his outfits charles has such awesome style what is the best gift you think anyone could ever receive i would say something that's handmade like i think obviously like i love to hand make things for people like a painting or just like a really nice card or even just like a baked good like if someone like baked me a cake or like baked me muffins or something like that would just be so cute oh by the way my whole outfit is thrifted of course actually no these pants are from princess polly but this is thrifted this is thrifted and then this is a little necklace that charles gave me that i think he got on etsy and then my earrings are from honey by lex let me, you know what and i'm also sitting on a yogi boat and what else is in my frame that i could and i got these from bed bath and beyond the lights and this mirror is from marshall's because i feel like I, you guys will probably ask me that in the comments yes and then you guys look at this as well my little okay so charles had one of these on his phone it's like a ring you can like adjust it and like twirl it around um or you can just go like that 
and it's from sync wire and i think we got it on amazon and it attaches to like a mount on my car with a magnet so it's just like boom, and then you can just like easily do directions on it would you ever get a cat yes i am most definitely a cat person i love cats can we speak Korean? Unfortunately, no, we don't know how to speak Korean. Um, we know like a decent amount of words and I can like read the alphabet, but when it comes to like actually like saying a sentence, like I literally do not know how, um, but that's something that I wanna get better at. So I do have like a little book that's like how to learn Korean and I'm gonna start reading it and hopefully I will be able to like learn at least a little bit so I can like kind of be a tiny bit conversational. We'll see, but like Korean is literally one of the hardest languages to learn. Someone said, what did I study or what, what did I study? What do I study in college? So my major is business administration and management, which is like singular major. And then I also have a minor in psychology. My favorite fast food is a bean crunch, bean supreme crunch. I am, that's definitely bean. Why, why is it so dark in my room right now? Should I turn on the light? It's literally so dark. Oh, no, not the light. Oh. Bean Crunch Wrap Supreme, Black Bean Crunch Wrap Supreme with no sour cream or cheese, and you could add guac if you wanted, and so good. Oh my god, the Crunch Wrap is so good. How many kids do I want in the future? Probably three. So I think three with like me and my siblings right now is like the perfect amount. I can't imagine having birth three times. That sounds painful, but I will have birth amnesia and it will be fine. Dream job is the job that I have right now doing YouTube. What's the thing I like most about my boyfriend Charles? Probably his humor or just like his outgoingness. Like I feel like he can just be himself like completely like fully himself in front of like everyone that he knows. Cause I feel like I'm usually kind of like reserved if you know what I mean, but Charles will just be like the life of the party and he'll be so much fun. And that is what I admire about him the most. What is my ultimate goal in life? I think just to have a family and like live in a little house and just be happy with my family and just do everyday things and enjoy my life day by day. That is my ultimate goal. And maybe to write more and become an author and learn how to speak French workout routine so i pretty much just go on walks really often and occasionally i'll do like a 20 minute hit workout or something um the no jumping ones or no fast movement ones because i don't like to do cardio um i'll do like weights like a dumbbell 20 minute workout i love mad fit she has really good fitness videos so i like to do hers or i like to do like a 20 minute yoga i'm really not into a long long exercise so like walks i can go on for like an hour but other than that, 20 minutes is enough for me. What do you want to do career-wise other than YouTube? Obviously, like, at least right now and, like, probably directly after college, YouTube will be my main, like, career path. But I think also it would be really cool to work, like, somehow in sustainability or, like, maybe work with, like, a clothing brand or something. I would love to have a job that gets me out of my house and, like, has me work on projects and talk with other people just so that, I don't know, YouTube can be, like, a really isolating job. So I would love to have a job where I can just go to and talk to other people. How do I keep my mental health good? How do I try not to, like, be too anxious or be too stressed? I feel like overall, I won't say, like, I have pretty good, strong mental health. I can get, like, kind of stressed a lot about things um, just because I feel like my schedule's really busy and I have, like, a lot of things to keep up with but I also realize like sometimes you just need to like take care of yourself first so like even if I have something that's like due immediately if it's going to like ruin my mental health for me to try to be finishing it super fast I'll just be like well that sucks but I'm just gonna take my time on it like if I have to like sometimes you just have to do things like that or being like you know what instead of exercising or something I'm literally just gonna like take a nap and sleep or I feel super hungry today so I'm gonna eat like the foods that I my body is craving. I think generally I try to keep on top of it by trying just to be positive in general, being grateful. I think it's super awesome if you're feeling really down to maybe like in your journal write like three things that you're grateful for every day. And then yoga helped me so much. Yoga really like just altered my brain I feel like because I would have to really like learn to keep my brain focused and just like calm and like not get bored of the yoga but like still be able to like tune into it and like have like the intention of doing yoga within yourself I guess so doing yoga helps so much I really think 
you guys should all try Leslie Fight Master's 90 day yoga challenge, yoga fit 90, something like that. Uh, my favorite Korean food is probably japjae, or I actually love jajangmyeon. It's probably jajangmyeon, but I don't eat jajangmyeon as often for some reason. My favorite color is green. I like green. Do you ever think of moving places? If yes, where? I don't know. I probably would move to California because that's where Amber lives, but I also think it would just be so cool to live anywhere. I actually really love living where I am right now, but maybe one day we could move to California or the Philippines or Europe or Montreal or Colorado or Oregon or I don't even know. We could go anywhere. I could live in a van. It really just depends where life takes me, guys. My zodiac sign is a Scorpio. Actually, sometimes when I plug it in with my birth date, it tells me that I'm a Libra. And I say, no, I'm a Scorpio. I'm like right on the cutoff, so Amber's a Libra, Libra, and I'm a Scorpio. Or at least I like to think that I'm a Scorpio. What is your Hogwarts house? I think it's Ravenclaw. I think it's Ravenclaw. Pineapple on pizza or no? Yes, on pizza. I love pineapple on pizza. Um, then a lot of people ask me where I get my clothes from. So for the most part, I get them pretty much only from the thrift store. So either like I go into the physical thrift store and get them or I'll get them online from like Depop, Poshmark, Thread Up. Um, and occasionally like I'll get clothes from like Princess Polly or I really love bags from Peta and Jane. I would say the vast majority of my closet, like maybe 90% is thrifted though. Bad habits of mine are picking at my skin and also biting my nails, extremely bad. How long have me and Charles been together? We have been together since I was a senior in high school, so approximately four years. It's gonna be our four year anniversary on November 8th. What are my birthday plans? So as you guys know, I'm turning 21 on October 23rd. I don't know what I'm gonna do for my birthday. Probably nothing. I'm not like trying to go out anywhere and I don't drink. So that's what people would usually do on their 21st birthday, right? I feel like I talked about this before. You guys, I feel like a lot of people are like, oh, like, why don't you do that? Or like, why don't you like, like, I never go to parties either. It's just not my thing. I just, I just don't like it. I'll probably just chill at home. Maybe like have dinner with my family. Yeah. Maybe we'll get like food, like takeout food or something from a place that I like. Fashion icons. Here we go. I feel like that's really that's all for now I feel like I talk so much on my podcast about like what happens like on a week-to-week -week basis that I can't even like think if there's something that I'm missing to say but if you guys really want to hear more about my life obviously you can go listen to the podcast but yeah thank you guys so much for tuning into today's q and I hope that you guys enjoy just hearing some little updates about me I guess and I hope that you guys have a wonderful beautiful day you go expel sunshine and happiness and rainbows and happiness into the world as you should. Bye.